reversal on diabetes, the reversal, remission. It is possible, and thank God I have done it with his help and guidance. I will show you the letter I received this past Monday. Let me start it back over for you. This is from my physician. And she was the first, this is the first time I met her. Um, my other doctor retired. He was a great guy. Ooh, see that 5.2? I have another letter that I got from him stating it was almost that. Or was it 5.2? I don't remember. But anyway, I'm writing. Well, thank God for that, too. Um, I'm writing to let you know it is possible. There's other things you can take, but still take your medicine prescribed by the doctor. But one needs to ask God what to take. And this just happened with less than two years in remission. So it is possible. If you want me to do a video on what I t t took, let me know. Or if you just want information, you can email me or leave a message and comment, and I'll let you know. Um, there was different things I took. And I really didn't stop, change. I, I don't like the word diet because that's a failure. Diet is failure. It's just changing the way you eat. Or maybe even not eating less of what you were eating pr previous. Because I didn't change, I did not cut out carbs. I still eat brown rice. I eat macaroni and cheese. Still do that. But if you want to know more on what I did, you can let me know. But you don't have to die on diabetes or have to be a death um, sentence. But you do need to take your medicine and there's other things too you can take. The medical doctor is not going to tell you, well all medical doctors, because you may find one or two, a few, they will tell you about other things you can take, you know, off the record. But there is things you can do faithfully along with your medicine. I'm, not, I'm never telling nobody to take, stop taking that medicine. I wouldn't do that because you do need that. Unless you want to be on a slab, soon to be six feet under, or a stroke, who wants that? But you can't, and I've told God I didn't want that. But you can um, reverse it, taking the right things along with your medication that the doctor prescribed to you. There's other things you can do, and they work. And I was on, lim well, I still am on um, low income, limited income. But God made a way for me to be able to get those um, other medicines that I needed. And some things was um, not medication, but um, seasoning. You know, I'll say it like that. One was cinnamon. You know, I'll put that out there. I didn't buy the cinnamon peels, but I did use a powder. And if I was cooking something sweet, like I like pancakes, I would put cinnamon in my pancake mix. And not just a little, a lot, because you're going to add syrup. And what will syrup do is the sugar. And it's not good for the kidneys, the palates, the blood pa palate, platelets, excuse me. But it didn't give me the spike um, after eating it. There's a few things you can do that works. They're out there. Like I said, the doctor's not going to tell you. And I didn't mention it to my doctor that I was doing that either. You know, the Lord just told me. I asked the Lord, Lord, to guide me to the right ones. Um... And there are doctors also um, in the um, social media, if you will. And if you want to know some of those, like I say, just email me or leave a message in the comment and I'll get back to you um, on just what, what it was. And you can look, look at it, um, ask God yourself what's good for you. But do not stop taking the medication. Because like I said, you don't want to have a stroke or six feet under being viewed. No. You can live a long, fulfilling life and reverse the diabetes that we brought on ourselves. And I can say that I brought it on myself because I would eat too many sweets. Sweets as a meal. Breakfast, sweets. 
slices of cake. I mean, that's foolishness now, I know. But I, don't get me wrong, I didn't try to cut out um, sweets. You know, I limit them. I did not cut out sweets. Um, I don't want to say too much without saying what all I use. But if you do want to know, I will be honest with you and tell you. And I can make a video on what I used to and show you different um, things I used. But I did tell you one thing. You start with that. Look that up. But the doctors here, yeah, they're not going to give you, say, not all doctors. Like I said, some may if you're talking to them about it. But I did not speak to my doctor on the issue. Um, he was just happy with my process, progress, excuse me, before he retired. And now this was the first time I met this lady, <coughs> a doctor which she's my doctor now and she was happy and looked over my she had told me when she came in she liked looked over my history and she liked the way my health was going you know you should li listen to your doctor but certain things you don't need to be doing but you gotta ask god but you do need to take the medication they say you need it take it because it could worsen or kill you if you don't and i want to live a long fulfilled life and see what god has for me more he has for me to do and see in this evil world I'm sorry, I see a fire truck outside on my security camera down the street. Um, and Lord help them. But like I said, you don't have to, it's not a death threat if you get diabetes and high blood pressure. There's things you can do to put it in remission and keep it there. And like I said, if you tell me to keep taking the medication, as it says on here, um, as a per, prevent worsening of your blood sugar, but it's okay but it's okay to stay to it's okay to continue to take to take it to prevent worsening of your blood sugars if she says to i uh, will keep doing it you know but it doesn't have to be a death sentence and thank god for that because i hadn't heard of anybody reversing diabetes so when they told me i had it I think it was a month or so, maybe a little longer than that, when I asked God what to t take to reverse it. And God's good. He'll lead you to the right ones. People on social media doctors. You know, I didn't have another doctor to go to and say, well, this doctor, like, I'm contradicting the doctor. No, I'm not doing that. He, like, I told him he was a good doctor because I was going to leave. I had another issue with another doctor. I was going to leave from him. And the Lord told me he knows medicine. <laughs> so um, I told him that, too. The Lord said he know medicine, but he did. He does know medicine. Thank God for that. Because he got me where I'm with this, where I'm at here with the grace of God, you know. And like I said, other things I took, taken. But it doesn't have to be a death sentence. You can reverse it. But keep taking your medicine regardless of whatever you want to add to it. Keep taking it. And if you want to know more what I did, leave a comment or you can email me and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you for listening. And just leave on this note, diabetes isn't a death sentence, it can be reversed.